It's been a long day, but I'm very excited to give y'all a review on these bad boys right here. These are the 8083 Ultras by Way of Wade. So let's get right into it. And these are amazing performers, guys. Oh my God, these are really good. And this rec center right here has the worst floor imaginable. They have classes with kids all day. And by classes, I mean like they're not even playing basketball. They're just like running around with like hula hoops and like bouncy balls. So their shoes are not clean. And let me tell you, these are worth your money for sure, especially if you are a guard. So let's dive straight into it. Really, this shoe consists of this full length boom midsole, and it does have some support features at the bottom. So your foot is not aching that much. And as a wide footer, these did fit true to size for me, but they are slightly longer than the Way of Way 10s. And you guys can see that it's very straight. It's pretty long. So they are true to size in my personal opinion, especially if you are a fast player, if you are a guard, you definitely want that one-to-one -one performance fit. However, they do fit just a tad bit longer than the Way of Way 10. So Definitely just keep that in mind, but it was not an issue for me. These definitely broke in. They felt true to size. The half a thumbs with space between my toe and the edge of the shoe, which felt really comfortable for me, especially as a wide footer where, so that's in terms of the fit. It does fit kind of narrow in the beginning. However, you do have to break it in. So I would just recommend going true to size for these. In terms of the cushion itself, guys, this cushion feels really nice super bouncy in the heel actually which is really surprising because obviously this is the entire cushion setup it's literally just this drop in midsole and the front is definitely court feel right because you have this plate right here that adds extra support to the bottom of your feet which also means that you're not really sinking into the cushion that much because you do have this hard plate right here so you definitely feel the court feel you feel fast you feel extremely lightweight this is an extremely lightweight shoe guys so to sum it all up in terms of the cushion the cushion is extremely responsive and pretty bouncy in the heel this is a guard setup guys so this is a definite guard shoe in my opinion big guys can definitely wear these obviously however if you are a fast guard these will serve you best in my personal opinion if you are a shooter these fit and just plays so well guys so in terms of the cushion very responsive i would recommend it for guards in terms of the traction this is by far my favorite part of the shoe this consists of a tough rubber outsole literally spelled t-u-f-f -F, and that's for extra durable rubber like xdr rubber but that means that you can use this both indoors and outdoors which is amazing and let me tell you this court like i was alluding to earlier is super dusty super bad disclaimer and preview i was playing in the kd16s and i had to take those off because they were not gripping to the floor so i switched into these oh my gosh guys oh my gosh it's so insane that i i don't even remember wiping i may have wiped once or twice but that was it this traction is really really good on dusty floors and this floor is downright bad so what that means is that once I go to a clean floor, these will work just as good, if not better. So this traction is very, very good. And you guys can see, I barely wiped it, or I, I don't even remember wiping it, but the grooves really don't attract that much dust. So this is a great sign for this model. I would really recommend it for the traction as well. In terms of breathability on this shoe, the materials are very lightweight and they have a lot of ventilation holes even in the tongue which is really cool so i didn't really feel hot in this shoe guys like this is not as hot as other shoes that i've tested main difference between the regular 8083 and the ultras is that the 8083 ultras this pair this oxygen colorway and all the other colorways have this carbon fiber plate right here which is supposed to add extra support and rigidity to the heel of the shoe so that you're more locked in this is such an innovative design and implementation of carbon fiber because I can't really think of a time when it was just literally on the side like this, keeping the heel in place, but it feels super supportive. Ankle support comes from the lockdown in your heel, not how high a shoe is. So I really did feel locked into the shoe, especially as a guard, because I was 
As a guard, I do not want to think when I'm playing basketball about my shoes. I don't want to think about the shoes at all. I don't want to wipe them. I don't want to do anything. And these fit really well and just was so seamless on my foot where I didn't have to think. You guys can see those white straps right here, but they also keep your heel locked in. It really does help. I like the sculpting here as well in the heel. The carbon fiber also extends to the outsole right here for extra support. The only gripe I have about this shoe is that they look and feel a little bit long, but it's not to the point where I can't play in it. Like obviously I played literally a minor gripe that I have. It doesn't affect my performance at all. Like obviously I played in that this shoe for that long, but that's my only gripe about this shoe. I would also say a downside is that I wish there was more cushion in the forefoot because I do understand that this is a court field shoe. It's a guard shoe, but if they could add like an extra like pod or some sort of thing of that nature in the forefoot, that would be really good because it does feel like very, very responsive. And I do wish in my preference that there would be a little bit more cushion in the forefoot. However, the entire ride feels super nice. I felt super duper fast in the shoe, guys. Super duper fast. I was very, very confident when playing, which is the number one sign of a good performer. Do you feel confident playing in the shoe? You don't even have to get buckets, honestly. You don't even have to get buckets. If you feel confident in the shoe and it fits you well and you're not hurting, that is a good performer to you. And honestly, that's how I, at the end of the day, base this criteria that I'm talking about. A little bit, I wish there was a little bit more forefoot cushion, but the traction on dusty floors is elite. The cushion is super responsive for fast guard play, which I am. And overall, I had no issues with support because of this carbon fiber on the side, which really kept my heel locked in. I highly, highly recommend these. these and the way of weight 10 are the best way of weight performers in my personal opinion, okay? These also look amazing. Really, really, I, I just really like these guys. I really do, but I do think the way of weight 10 low is better, but I'm pretty sure these are cheaper. So the way of weight 10 low feels way more bouncy and the traction is top tier and they fit one-to-one -one like a Kobe, but these are a tad bit long, but these just play so well so so well and arguably they look better than the way of weight 10 low in my personal opinion these are elite so guys if you do want to get a pair of these i will leave an affiliate link down in the description and i promise you will like these honestly unless you have like a really really wide bigfoot foot like then maybe these will fit too tight for you but for the majority of people majority of hoopers you will like these, especially if you're a guard. And I'm gonna put clips in this video to show you guys how I play a little bit, but these are extremely good. I'm telling you, these, honestly, I like these over the Luka 2s, definitely over the Tatum 1s. I like them over the Jaw ones. I do like because the, the, the traction is better. These have a loud squeak, great support. Way of Weight knows what they're doing, guys. And if they could put a little bit more cushion in the forefoot, that would be amazing. But overall, y'all, let me know what you guys think of this oxygen colorway right here. Definitely get the Ultra version, in my personal opinion, just because they look better than the 8083s. But the 8083s, I haven't tested those yet. But these just look 10 times better. The colorways are better. And guys, Way of Weight knows what they're doing. So go cop in the affiliate link in the description below. And let me know what you guys think of the aesthetics, how they perform if you're playing in them. And I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace.